Hi everybody, Josh with Talk About Trek here, and today we're going to talk about Riker toys, specifically William Riker's 11 Playmates. Uh, maybe he has more, I don't know, but I have 11 William Riker Playmates, and we're going to take this day to have a look at them. And why today? Uh, today specifically, August 19th, is Jonathan Frake's birthday, and it also would have been the 100th birthday of Gene Roddenberry. So it's a perfect day to have a look at some of the great toys that Playmates put out uh, for this character. Uh, let's start with one of the larger ones, or probably what is the largest ones they produced. And this is, of course, the Space Talk William Riker, who is in his box, so his batteries are certainly dead. Let's see if we can get anything out of him. Nope, nothing. Uh, he would say, engage, shields up, red alert, and I think that's about it. Uh, this one is pretty interesting. On the back, what it talks about is his incident on Nirvala 4, where he was uh, serving aboard the Potemkin, but then was trapped, and a transporter double was then created. Which, of course, is Thomas Riker here. And if anyone watched Lower Decks today, then, uh, you know, th that'll have a little bit of extra meaning for him as well. So there's two. I have a closer look here at the Thomas Riker. This came out with the Deep Space Nine. You, of course, you get your pog with that. Space Cats slamming those. That's good. We'll put them off to the side here. And then we'll go take it back to Cadet Riker, Thomas, Troublemaker. So here, of course, with the Starfleet Academy line, we've got our Cadet William Riker, babyface Riker here, wearing his uh, very special geothermal suit. And of course, if you got Windows 98, you can run that Starfleet Academy game and have a wonderful time with that, I'm sure. Now... We'll get into the regular line here. So the first one that Playmates put out was this guy here. And uh, this, I think, is one of the ones that, uh, well, one of the better ones that I like, mainly because of the just the fantastic action pose you've got here. Look at that. Hands up in the air, stop. He's got his phaser arm at the ready. Ready to pose here. So that's your first, your classic Riker there. Let's see if we can pose him in his classic phaser pose. Stop or I'm going to shoot. There he is. Okay, now, after that, we've changed it up. So he's been in a bit of a battle here, and now we've got the battle battle worn Riker with the rips in his uniform and the uniform is a little bit different as well as you can see different color different piping on it as well but the pose is the same now when Riker needs to do something a little fancier you can always bust out your dress uniform Riker we've got here and then Keeping on with the nice ones is the fantastic Admiral Riker from the All Good Things episode. And then this one with very bad elbows, no articulating elbows. I think this is the Generations Riker. But there he is anyway, too. So we've got five, six, seven eight so far there let's look at 9 10 11 so this is Riker when he went undercover there and his face is a little damaged because I think that we turned him into Tony Clifton when I was younger for a specific video but uh there he is anyway and then we've got our uh, Action Riker here, 
who unfortunately is out of action at the moment, but I think he would uh, wave his phaser rifle at you in a threatening manner. But now he just stands still. Up there, sir. There he is. Okay. And last but not least would be our first contact, Riker. In the nice first contact style uniform. So, there you have it, folks. Oh, he's going gonna, he's gonna to cause the whole thing to come down here. We can get them all back up. That's fine. Okay, so, these are the 11 playmates of William Riker. At least that I have. Maybe there's more out there. There probably is more out there. Uh, I would have to say, out of all of them, uh, the original two are the best simply because of the fantastic posing that they can do. So let's just take a closer look here. And I'm going to point out something I like. Look at his foot. Do you see that foot? Do you see that? His foot is up, which means that you can make him pose up in a perfect action pose. So, I mean, that's, that's good. I don't know how many other figures have a foot that's been like that. So, I mean, that's great. So, thank you for taking this ride with me today and having a look at all these fantastic Playmates toys. Uh, again, if you haven't been watching Lower Decks, tune in for that because that show is fantastic. Uh, if you're a fan of Riker, and who isn't a fan of Riker, then you get to see more Riker and you get to see a different side of Riker and you get to see this beautiful ship on the screen and they've done just such a fantastic job and that's the Titan of course and just getting to see it on the screen and getting to see canon adventures of the Titan is just such a cool thing so it's just been such a good time watching that and uh, just a happy birthday to Jonathan Frakes and happy birthday to all you Star Trek fans out there whose birthday it might be today and thanks for watching and tune in next time uh, we're probably going to move on from here, talk about maybe Data, Worf, who knows. There's a world of playmates to explore, and we're going to talk about most of them. Thanks again. Bye.